Hey guys, good evening and welcome back again to your Academy Reading English channel. I hope all of you are doing well. My dear students, since a lot of students are continuously asking about the state-wise expected cutoffs, so I thought to make one video out of this so that you can get to know the most expected cutoff in your states. Okay? Since in the yesterday's session, I told you the cutoff would be 50 marks lesser than the last year's cutoff, right? But my dear students, since yesterday, whatever responses we have been getting from the students, the cutoff is definitely going to be lesser than that. And here in this particular session, I'll let you know what is going to be the most expected cutoff in different states. Okay? Point number one. Point number two, the ones who have not watched this particular session, which I took live a few minutes back, please and please do watch this particular session, right? This is the session I'm talking about, right? I know a lot of students right now would be depressed, would be anxious, would be confused. So this is particularly for them. Please and please go through this particular session, right? On priority. And watch the session so that you will get to know what is next, what to do next. Okay? Please and please watch it. Alright, if I talk about the state-wise cutoffs. My dear students, first of all, if I talk about the Andaman and Nicobar. Last year, in case of Andaman and Nicobar, in the general category, the cutoff was 665. Right? This year, directly you can subtract 70 marks. In the yesterday session, I told you 50 marks you have to subtract. But no, from, the, from all the data which we are collecting across the country, that's why I am giving you uh, the decrease in the cutoff a little more, right? By just looking at the different marks which students are getting. So subtract 70 marks in these particular, uh, in general category as well as OBC, as well as uh, EWS, SC, as well as ST, right? Subtract direct 70 marks from the last year's cutoff in this particular state, okay? If I talk about the Arunachal Pradesh, Arunachal Pradesh, again, you can subtract 70 marks directly from the last year's cutoff. This was your last year's cutoff cut in the different categories. Directly, you can subtract some 70 marks from here. Okay. Similarly, my dear students, if you talk about the Andhra Pradesh, right? And in Andhra Pradesh, cutoff actually goes higher than the other states generally, right? In last year, the, in the general category, the cutoff in the first round, right? It was 660. Now, directly, you can subtract 70 marks from this in all these categories. Okay. Similarly, my dear students, if you talk about Assam, in Assam, this particular cutoff was the round one cutoff last year, again, subtract 70 marks from all of this. You are going to get the expected cutoff this year in the state of Assam. My dear students, in the state of Bihar, again, these are the last year's cutoff. Again, subtract 70 marks. That's going to be the most expected cutoff, right, in the round one of this year's NEET 2025 when it comes to the state Bihar. When it comes to the state of Chandigarh, my dear students, Chandigarh, you know, the cutoff really, really, really goes high, right? So again, this is the last year's cutoff in different categories and you just need to subtract 70 marks from it. Why am I, am I exactly telling you 70 marks you have to subtract? Yesterday, since I told you 50 marks you have to subtract, but no. When we analyzed all the data, right, across the country in the Unacademy platform, we got to know it has to be more than 50, right, by analyzing everything. That's why there is a slight change which I'm telling you right now. Similarly, talking about uh, Chhattisgarh, Right? Again, subtract 70 marks. I hope you are taking the screenshots of all of these. Uh, Dadar and Nagar, again, you, you are going to subtract 70 marks from the last year's cutoff, as you can see over here. Similarly, when it comes to the Delhi, in Delhi, 700 was last year's round one cutoff in the general category. Again, subtract 70 marks. So, uh, 630, 620 would be the cutoff in Delhi this year. Similarly, when it comes to Goa, this is your Goa, my dear students. Again, you have to subtract 70 marks from each category. And after subtracting 70 marks from each category, you'll be getting the actual cutoff in, the, in Goa. When it comes to Gujarat, again, uh, decrease 70 marks from these, you're going to get your actual cutoff when it comes to Goa. My dear students, in the Haryana, in Haryana, again, this is the last year's cutoff. So again, you are going to subtract some 70 marks from it. Okay. Similarly, when it comes to Himachal, this was the round one cutoff, right, in different categories. Okay, when it comes to the Himachal Pradesh, so again, you are going to subtract some 70 marks in general 70. My dear students, this can be, see, I'm not telling you exactly how to subtract 70. It can be 65 also, it can be 75 also. Okay, be careful of that. It can be, you, uh, it can be 65 also, it can be 75 also, it can be 70 also, right? So this is the most approximate, approximate number which we are giving you after analyzing the data across the country from different students, which we, I mean, which we have on our platform. Similarly, when it comes to the state of Jammu and Kashmir, in the round one category, it was 663. Now, directly you can subtract, you can directly make it to 590, right? 590 is going to be the expected cutoff in the boys category, right? In the state of Jammu and Kashmir. Similarly, when it comes to the girls category, again, you are going to reduce the marks by 70 to 80. 
right in the state of jammu and kashmir perfect last year if the cut off was 615 so a uh, subtract directly 70 to 80 marks from that that's going to be the most expected cut off in the girls category in the state of jammu and kashmir right similarly when it comes to jharkhand again you are going to subtract some 70 marks from each of them and get the expected cut off uh, karnataka again subtract some 70 marks from all of them and get the expected cut off uh, your kerala get the subtract 70 marks right and get the expected cut off madhya pradesh again subtract some 70 marks get the expected cut off this is the maharashtra cut off right subtract some 70 marks again okay and manipur again you are going to subtract some 70 marks right and get the expected cut off this is the last year's cut off expect uh, subtract 70 marks from each of them and get it similarly in case of meghalaya right again subtract 70 marks from each of them right well uh, i could not get the data of obc ews sc and st in the meghalaya so i just have the general category so subtract some 70 marks directly and you will be having approximate cut off here as 605 now similarly mizoram again subtract 70 okay nagaland again subtract 70 Uh, Odisha again subtract some seventy marks. Pondicherry again subtract some seventy marks. Punjab is the uh, last year's cut off when it comes to the state of Punjab, right? So you can again subtract some seventy marks here. Rajasthan where the cut off goes actually high, right? So again you can subtract your seventy marks from here. In the state of Tamil Nadu, right? In the state of Tamil Nadu, my dear students, again you are going to subtract seventy marks from each of them, and you will be getting this year's ex most expected cut off. Uh, when it comes to the state of tamil nadu uh, similarly telangana again subtract some 70 marks right and tripura again subtract some 70 marks from the last year's cut off this is the last year's cut off again subtract some 70 marks and you will be get, getting the most expected cut off when it comes to the year 2025 perfect since lot of lot of students asked about the expected cut off and after analyzing scores which we got from the students since yesterday so i had to change my words basically last last time in the yesterday session i had I told you to subtract fifty marks, basically, but no, it has to be more than fifty. So up approximately, and uh, it has to be, I mean, less than seventy. Whatever was your, whatever was the expected, whatever was the actual cutoff in the round one category last year, you have to subtract definitely some seventy marks from that. Okay, and all those students who are not falling into any of the categories, who could not score well, right? Who got, I mean, less than five hundred, etc., etc. Please and please, please and please, watch this particular session on priority, my dear students. because this particular session is going to be super relieving for all of you and in this particular session i have told you all the things which you are supposed to do at this particular point of time no need to go no need to get depressed or something perfect just watch this particular session so that you will get the clear cut idea of what to do and what not to do in the upcoming time right i have given you the, all the details about everything in this particular session uh, wherein i have told you whether it is the good time to quit or whether it's a good time to continue your studies perfect so with this taking leave i'm posting this video pretty much late because a lot of students texted me on telegram firstly asking me about uh, what is going to be the expected cut off this year so that's the reason why i have made this particular video right now so that i could tell you exactly uh, what is going to be the most expected cut off when it comes to the neat 2025 and all those students who could not score well please and please watch this particular session on priority my dear students watch this particular session on priority okay so take care god bless you all and love you all bye bye